All right, um, welcome back to China. Um, we'll just kind of recap where we're at. So as you can see, um, we've got uh, New Beijing working on the Great Library. It's going to take 27 turns, so it's a, a big project for us. Um, if we can get it off the ground, um, that'll be really, really good for us. We've got some barbarians, um, which are aliens in our little game. Uh, coming over here to try and kill us. We've got a worker working on a wheat farm. We've got these warriors um, who we're going to have move over to the the workers to protect them. We're working on mining, which will eventually lead us to masonry. We've got a scout um, over here somewhere. Yeah, right here. Okay, so these French guys have been fighting these these people. So what we're gonna do, normally I wouldn't fight with my scout, but it's just too tempting to just finish that guy off and get some culture. Besides, the French are part of the security council and we should be helping them. Um, some people could call that helping the French. Other people would make, call that letting them do all the hard work and we're reaping the benefits. You know, six of one, half a dozen of another. The good thing, aliens are dead, and our guys aren't. So let's wipe this guy out too, get that culture and that experience. So when the odds are dramatically in our favor, the scouts can fight. Um, and we just kind of took advantage of that little situation right there. Um, this guy is going to, like I said, move down here. We're going to get the next... Uh, Open train benefit, and we're just gonna heal. Okay, let's see what we get. So we should be able to pick a new social policy. And we got that a lot faster because of that battle that our scouts fought. And they get a bonus. Um, we're gonna give them some extra scouting. Um, that's their, their primary purpose, is to scout things out. I don't want to fight this guy. This guy is fully healed up and really dangerous. Um, I don't want to tussle with him. Uh, we only beat up on weak kids that we can take their lunch money really easily. Not people stronger than us. Doesn't seem like a good, a good battle for us to fight, so we're not going to. If we can't win, we're not going to fight it. Unless we absolutely have to. So we're going to pick up the aristocracy which takes us from 26 turns to 22 turns. So now we're at turn 49 for finishing the Great Library. So you can see we're chipping away at it. Um, time is naturally progressing and we're filling up work for it, but we're also really gearing our society for this. Um, keep going down here. Um, the extra range, hopefully if there's any... Um, any ancient ruins around we'll be able to see them for other people. But I think this area may have already been gone over by the French. We certainly met them over here, which means they're... This is Camorra. Okay, so there's a couple more ruins. Looks like down here. And there's more barbarians. So I want to get... Yeah, that's exactly what I want to do. I want to move back around here and get those ruins. Hopefully without getting attacked by the barbarians. Well, if we do get attacked by the barbarians, um, it won't be that bad. The warrior is just going to go on alert and guard these workers. These workers are a big investment for us. Um, I don't want to see them murdered. Okay, the scouts are pretty hurt. Um, we're going to run away as fast as we can. These scouts may not be long for the world, but hopefully they can get that ancient ruin for us before um, their untimely death. But, you know, I would trade them for um, those ruins, you know, any day. So there's these barbarians that we see. Um, I want to wait for them. I don't want to go out and meet them in the field. I want them to come up here and try and attack us because then Beijing can lend its support to that battle. 
that'll really swing it in our favor. Um, and we are all about trying to pile as many bonuses on as we can. So I'm going to move up here. It's a little bit riskier. Um, and try and get this incense. Oh, god damn it. I moved the wrong guy. That was dumb. Alright, so Beijing is, is chipping away at the Great Library. I think we're gonna die. No, no, we lived. That's amazing. Alright, let's get that. Okay, we got a map of the area. Not that great. Um, does tell us a little bit about it, and what I gather from that is we're going to die next turn when this guy comes down here and fights us. I don't see much we can do about it, but that's my prediction. Alright, the workers... Oh, son of a... I didn't think about this. Um, the workers cannot build, cannot get the incense because we don't have the technology. Let's move back over to the farm. Back over to here. Because we're trying to get um, the marble. Sometimes in the beginning it's kind of hard to remember what you have and don't have. Because some things you're so used to just having because they're so basic. But you don't always have them. So that guy died. Um, I wish that hadn't happened, but you know, scouts scouts are not warriors. Uh, they're supposed to uh, uncover the world for us. So this guy is going to. I'm gonna pop him down one square just to take a look around. And down to here. I feel a little more comfortable leaving this guy around um, because I don't see any barbarians. Um, that doesn't mean that they're, they're still around somewhere. So I'm not going to take him more than a square or two, but I can knock out some of this darkness over here. The meek shall end. Let's go to this hill. Okay. So we can build farms. That's pretty much what we can build. So I'm going to go here and build a farm here. We should be able to build... Let's go over to here. Actually, we should—we just got mining, so we should be able to mine this desert hill over here. And you can see that food production took us from a stagnation to growing in one turn. Keep going this way. I don't want to get too far away from the city um, because barbarians could pop down from up here and, and really ruin our day. These workers, uh, we're gonna build a mine. See? There's barbarians right there. So we're gonna come back up here. I wanna, like I was saying before, I want them to fight me within the range of the city borders. I don't wanna fight outside where my archers are. I wanna lure them into the, the zone of death that we've created. They're trying to get over to my worker. Um, stop that. Go back into Beijing for a turn. I'd rather be safe than lose you. Masonry we're going to get in 7 turns. Great Library in 12 turns. Go ahead and shoot that guy. The worker can go up here. The worker can go there. And now with the warrior protecting him, the worker can still build the mine even while this battle is going on all around them. Um, our people are are brave when they have warriors to defend them. Shoot him one more time. And then the warrior will go in, pick up a little bit of experience, and we'll kill off those barbarians. This guy is going to build a mine. Let's 
build, let's buy. Uh, we can't build a shrine yet. I was thinking we could buy, we could just buy the shrine since we're putting everything into the great library and I really want those um, religious bonuses, but it's not to be. So I'm going to send this guy um, up here, just trying to fill out the, the coastline without getting too far away from the workers. I mean, I still, my still, I still want to protect them, that's my primary goal. Um, but we can get a little further away from them. Like, I'm going to pop up on this hill, see if there's anything worthwhile up there, and then probably head back down. I don't want to get too far away. No, I don't really see anything. Um, whatever is up here is just going to have to wait any further, and we're going to get so far away from the workers that we won't be able to respond to that barbarian camp that is still very much alive. Um... Here. No, keep working on the mine. You, warrior, come down here. So the masonry is going to be done in two turns. So the, once the mine is done, we'll go over and start building the, the marble. Um, which may or may not be able to help uh, the Great Library. One way or another, it's going to be probably done by the time we can start building the marble. But it will help us with our next... Uh, wonder if we decide to build another wonder of the world, which I'm sure we will build many many wonders of the world but... How happy are those whose walls already? Okay, so we're gonna get a policy So we could pick this up to get a free culture building, but we already built a monument because um, I didn't want to wait for the culture So I think we're gonna go with Liberty and what we're gonna do um, we'll decide at the time, we're probably going to go down here to get the extra, the settler, um, to build a second city. Being able to expand out would be good. This will be done in three turns. Um, this warrior can just heal up. Actually. He's going to go down here, and the warrior is going to go with him. So getting the marble will give us, um, you can see when it's worked by a city, you get plus two gold, um, you get four happiness, so it'll be, it'll be nice to be working. It also gives you, um, a bonus when you're building ancient and, I think, classical wonders. So that'll be, that'll be nice. So we're getting really close to the library, I really hope we get it, I hope we don't end up, um, getting, you know, one turn away and then someone else builds it. That would not be... That would not be a good feeling. Alright, so now we're going to pick up um, archery. We need those archers um, really badly. Um, we also need calendar, too. But we get a free technology when we get the Great Library. Um, if we get the Great Library. Um, I don't necessarily... I probably want to use it on whatever the most expensive technology that I have available to me is. Um, but we might just use it to pick up Calendar, because it would be useful. Really useful. Keep working on a quarry. But I, I don't know yet. We'll have to see if we get it. One turn away. This is kind of where... what we've been working towards. So I'm pretty sure we're going to get it. Um, I'm not 100% for sure, but I imagine we will. Um, so we can shoot these warriors, which we'll do. Our warriors can... How I was saying, normally I want them to come closer to me. Um, that is true, but we can just wipe out these archers. Um, and this guy has to cross a river which takes all his turns before he could get to our worker. So um, there's not that much drawback to doing this. So we're going to do it. Yeah, so you can see we just we stomped those workers. Um, these workers are going to keep building that quarry. And hopefully this is going to be the great library. It's 
working on other players. Yes. So this is really good for us. Um, so we got a free paper maker from the deal. We got a free technology. Um, let's shoot this guy. Uh, all kinds of good things happened for us. So let's move this warrior over to here. Again, we're guarding that uh, that guy. So now we have to choose a free technology. So the one that is cost the most is drama and poetry. So we could do that. Calendar will only take six turns. This guy's not going to be done um, for I think it was seven turns to start. It's probably five turns. So I think I'm okay just naturally picking up um, picking that up. Um, the other option, yeah, we're going to get drama and poetry. There's just 20 turns for free is, is huge. What is drama but life with the dull bits cut out? The king's might is greater than human, and his arm is very long. Let's see if the French have anything to trade with us. Bonjour. J'écoute. Not really. Um, we could set up an embassy, but we'd have to pay them to do it, and I don't want to do that. Um, they have some luxury. They've got some wine. But we don't have anything to really trade them. I don't want to give away my marble. It's not... I don't want to give them the extra ability to build Wonders of the World, certainly. So that being said, we got the Great Library. We're going to choose our next thing. So I think we're going to queue up some to build some things. We're going to get a shrine. And we'll, we'll put a we'll buy a an archer when we can. We're going to get a granary. And Yeah, I think that'll do it for us. So those are things we're definitely going to want in our city. Um, we're going to take Beijing off of its production focus and let it grow. Getting the Great Library was was worth it, in my opinion, to sacrifice our growth. But now that that's over... The haft of the arrow had been feathered with one of the eagle's own plumes. We are... So they pillaged one of our farms, which uh, is not good, but we can repair it. So we're going to go back to a default focus. Um, growing the city larger is important, and these things, they're nice to have, but no one's going to beat us to being able to produce them. The other one was a race, and it was worth giving something up to get that prize. We, we got something far more valuable than what we gave up. That being said, we're going to shoot these guys. We're going to buy an archer, as we promised. And now that we have an archer and a warrior, we're going to start going and wrecking these barbarian encampments. We're going to choose our next bit of research, and that's going to be it for us. So, um, calendar is what we want. Alright, so um, I hope you come back and continue to explore the world of Alpha Centauri, a brave new world for us to explore and settle. Thank you.